Hello, dear viewer, and welcome back to Breach Wanderers with me, Jalanon, at Luna Nebula Gaming. I did go ahead and buy the, I want to say it was $2.99 for the 50% increase in resource gains after runs. It seems like people are enjoying Breach Wanderers, so I figured might as well invest uh, now that the store is working, which I think was probably due to them doing an update or something. Uh, and now, after you make that purchase, it shows that you can get a booster pack for another 30% increase to all gold, aether, and experience, and also giving you a bunch of more resources. Uh, recently, mm, I think we go ahead, based on what people have said, and open some more packs of cards with our aether. And now, another one. We got some phase grace, apparently. Guarded Strike, that might be good for a strike deck. I do want to try a strike deck again with Rowden. Or maybe Morella, who we are going to take on a run today. So, let's go see what her default deck is like. So now we have Merle. I'm sorry, I called you Morella. Uh, so yes, we're going to try and be somewhat useful with a new character. We can create smoke bombs and things. Yeah. Well, let's go back real fast just to double check that there isn't something else we might want to buy before the run. Like, the more choices is interesting. Another rest supply. I don't feel like we need it at this stage in the game. Hmm. These are all nice, but not necessary. Whereas you... They could purchase items from the market before every run. That's interesting. Hmm. I do want to be able to maybe unlock another bounty. We're still doing the guild haul. Okay, what's another character looking like? 750, 750, 1500. Okay. You're not cheap. Oh, we can get Kaitan through a quest. Okay then. Hmm. Well, we're definitely taking Merle out and about. But yeah, I think I will go ahead and unlock another bounty slot. Win boss fights with Merle. Well, okay. Clearly, good decision. Here we go. <laughs> we're gonna try to do that. All right, Merle. Let's start. Without knowing exactly how you work, because it's more fun that way. Okay, so defeat the final boss of the Mushroom Forest. We just need to get there. I doubt that you are good at AoE damage, so we may want to go for the boss on the right, right? Is this a new final boss? Looks like a book with antennae. Okay, so, yeah, let's try this right side, I think. We can get an early elite, maybe. Let's take a look at the deck a little more closely this time. So focus, mana shield, those are good cards. Shadow focus, huh. We have a lot of mana cards. 50% crit chance and 50% evasion chance. Uh but we lose those when using damaging cards, huh? Okay, so if we end with hidden, that would be nice for evasion's sake. But if we attack when we're trying to evade, that would ruin it. Got it. Uh, backstab seems kind of good. Yeah, okay. So wait, does that... You do 100% bonus damage, so 16, and then would that still have a crit chance to it? Seems pretty good. Home, more critical. Smoke bombs. Okay. So yeah. Gain hidden if you weren't hidden. Draw one if you were hidden. Okay, so that's one way to cycle through. And then shielded strike is decent, and then introspection for more card draw. All right, let's continue. Okay, Merle. We're gonna try to set up some combos with you. We only have four mana at the moment. Shadow focus. So we can get hidden immediately. Then we could use the smoke bomb to draw more stuff. Hmm. And we want a backstab. And critical. So critical's pretty cheap. So we can definitely get the critical shadow focus backstab off. And that seems pretty good. Is Shadow Focus a mana card? It is. So can I do Shadow Focus, Mana Shield? Hey, there we go. Another Mana Shield, which we don't 
need me, but it's nice. Then we'll still have 10 armor at the end of being hit. Uh, so we've done that. I can then hone my strikes. Okay, good. We haven't lost hidden. And we can backstab for 24. 824. We have a 100% chance to crit. So, yeah, looks like 16 plus half, right? Right. And then, do I want to smoke bomb again? I think I do for that evasion. Yeah. I would gain two hidden. Hmm. We can create some more smoke bombs, and then that'll also put some in our discard pile, so... <laughs> Why not? <laughs> okay, I don't want to use up all my stuff, but... We now have three stacks of evasion, right? Hmm... So, I think that means we have a 50% chance for three attacks. I'm gonna smoke bomb again. And then Shadow Focus for free. My word, what? That feels like an almost infinite combo, potentially, already. Uh, I did take eight damage. There goes one of my stacks of hidden. But not all of them. <laughs> so, what do we want to do here? We could draw two. That seems pretty good. We're still doing 24 damage. We don't need that, so let's do Shield Strike first. I th oh, I'm wrong. I'm just wrong. <laughs> it's like, surely we don't need that much damage, and I forgot to account for the armor that it clearly put on. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Well then, I am thinking... We do some introspection here. Then, go ahead and draw another card. Oh good, there's our other backstab, which is excellent. So, now I want to do focus, because I have no more mana, therefore I now get four mana! Four. Which is wonderful. And then we can mana shield to get some more shield. And then, I can focus upon the shadows. May they hide us and guide us to 24 damage. Then we can prep some more smoke bombs and find me, maybe, another, just, you know, give me that backstab again. Come on. Where's backstab? Is there no more backstab? Okay, uh, I guess there's no reason not to use hone here, but I'm gonna just wait, I'm just gonna wait. Let's hope we can get that backstab back. We were not lucky enough. But hopefully we've cycled enough to find none. Zip. Zero. Nada. And now you have four armor, so I need to do at least ten damage to kill. Okay. Well then. So we kind of want to reach the focus point to get four mana. Which we can do. Pretty easily. Yeah. Get some more smoke bombs. Hey, there's our backstab. Okay, so this already does like 16. That's not bad. But it could be better. And then we can do focus. Then we can do mana shield. Then we can do shadow focus. Hmm. Shadow focus? Still 16. Find me. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Now it's 24. There it goes. Wonderful. That's all we were looking for, was that 24. Okay, Shadow Focus is still great. Gain Evasion this turn. We really don't need with our Smoke Bomb combos, but that is interesting. Not reduced at end of turn? Wait, what? Huh. Not sure how to feel about that. Arcane Aegis, or Aegis, or however you want to say that. Apply 12 Arcane to any enemy, gain 12 shield that's triggered in Arcane Divination. So basically, deal 12 damage, gain 12 shield. The first time you use this on an enemy, it gets worse over time. We do need more damage, I think. Right now, it's just the backstabs. So I will take Arcane Aegis, or Aegis. Hmm. Will Athena protect us with her shield? No, but we do have magic powers now. Hmm. 
Okay, I could do the arcane thing already. We have focus. Yeah, yeah, I think that'll work. All right. Boom. Okay, it's 10 damage, not 12 damage. Because it's 10 first. So it'll work twice, basically. Uh, on one enemy. Hmm. Except bosses. So now I think we smoke bomb. Then we focus our energies. Then we shadow focus. Yes. It's all coming together. And then I still need to find critical hits, but we don't have them, so we're just going to kill. Take that. Okay. But we have plenty of armor. So that worked out. Hmm. What do we want to do here? We don't have a normal focus. Let's do introspection to draw more cards, get rid of some of that extra mana, since we have more mana generation. Uh, we're going to use home, for sure. Shield strike only does 6 damage, critical 50% chance. Eh. Eh. Let's try to find more stuff. Find me more good cards, my good man. Yes, okay. So we have a backstab. That and that. Okay, yeah, and the teal border is basically when your card's special effects seem to be active. So yeah, that's 24 damage. It's not bad. In fact, I think we just win here, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, we maybe could have done like one more thing, but didn't need to. Didn't need to. So we can get Tempest Strike. Ooh. An AoE damage. If we do face the mini boss that has extra characters, that could be nice. But vulnerable plus our critical hat. Uh, yeah. That seems really good. Huh. Vanish, though. If your last card scored a critical hit, gain evasion and cleanse yourself one time. Create a smoke bomb. That combos really well. Uh, what do we need more of? Hmm. I feel like I want to take Corrupt Blast here. It might not be the right choice, depending on what we're about to face, but uh, I want to take it. I, I just wanted to take it. It's the coolest one. Okay. Um, we can gain hidden without using our smoke bomb. So that's what I want to do. So we're going to start with Shadow Focus. Then we get Mana Shield. Then we can get Hone. Hone on the range. Huh. Okay. Smoke Bomb draw. Preparations are prepared. Okay. Uh, looks like I did a quest, which is pretty good for me. Not for the enemy. Hmm. Then we have choices. So 24, we have a 100% chance of that. Yes. We take that. And then, okay, still 100%. Good, good. Ah, and I think we're good. Wonderful. All right. Yeah, if we can kill stuff before they can buff it anyway, then it's like, eh. You know, that seems like a good choice. Hmm. We have more options here. Uh, focus. So we want to reach our zero mana. Which is definitely possible. I think we do... Do we prepare? It's pretty good. We're going to prepare. Then we do one of these. Take one of those. Okay, I've got my arcane aegis. Hmm. Uh, that does block every hit this guy does. We don't get to corrupt it. But that's okay. I think we do this. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Then we can do that. We can still backstab. 100% chance of 24 damage. Yes, and I think we can still get away with Corrupted Blast. You deal 9. There we go. Okay. Wonderful. Choose a card. Any card. Assassinate. Kill any enemy with 30 or less health. Otherwise, give it Ambush, Crystallize, and Vulnerable. Huh. Not bad. Crystallize gets better over time. 
We already have a way to deal vulnerable. Oh, Relentless Assault, though, plus our crits and everything. Draw a strike and gain mighty weight. Do our... Do our backstabs... They do count as strikes. Okay, so... Hmm. That's like 16 right now. This is basically always 15, even if we don't get our cool combos off. But mighty, though. Looking pretty mighty fine. And it's free. You know what? It's free. And it gets us our backstabs. Okay. I think that makes sense. We continue. We gain our reroll if we need it. Uh, and then where do we go? Combat. I guess we try the munch rooms. Alright. Let's see how this goes then. So we've got our focus, so we want to spend everything before we use focus. Which is definitely possible, it's just what order we do it in. And I think... Yeah, we don't have our shadow focus, so that doesn't matter. So we have to use a smoke bomb to gain it. And it's just going to happen. Oh, and we can get another backstab. Sweet. Glorious more backstabs. Okay, so we can do that. And then I don't even need to, yeah, I don't even need to add more hidden smoke bombs if I don't want to. Well, okay, we get shield strike instead of backstab. It is 27 damage, though. We only gained, like, 3 damage. So, the mighty only affects the base damage, not the critical. Ah, oh. oh, okay, so that's, that's a little less good, but that's okay. It helps us cycle through our strikes and get to our backstab, so um, I'll take it. I'll take it. Shielded Strike, that's still very good. And maybe we can grab one more. No, but we get a little more hidden. I would have to spend all my mana at the chance to... No, no. Okay. Introspection, we drew you too late. I am sorry. I will be... Happy that I evaded a little bit, I guess, but it didn't really matter. I would have ended up at 10 armor anyway. Okay, Corrupted Blast here seems pretty great. We've got Shadow Focus and Mana Shield. Okay, so we don't need to worry about Focus being super awesome. Zero mana. So we do that. That happens. We can do Arcane Aegis. It's only doing four damage to me. I don't need to do that. It'd be nice to draw into something we want more, like backstab. Just saying, 27 damage is pretty good, and then we can win. Then you win. All right. Oh, to the back of the line with you. And then, choose a card. Maybe, maybe not. Okay, Cleansing Shield. Wouldn't be bad, in case the worst ever happened. Permanent Leech is interesting for if we had a debuff deck, but we don't. So I'm, I'm more interested in Vanish. Okay, I'm in. Force Armor. Wait, what? Max health minus 80%. We gain more shield and max shield. And honestly, because of our evasion, I think we can get away with it. This is probably stupid. 16 health. <laughs> oh, it hurts. It's so good, but uh, we'll, we'll see if that is, in fact, accurately said or not. Hopefully it hurts not. That, that would be better. Oh, we start with 30 shield? Oh. Okay, then. I thought we'd start with 13 and was still willing to take that trade, which is probably, yeah. This is, this is probably just better. Let's be real. So, shadow focus. Shadow focus seems pretty good. No reason not to do those first, since we don't have normal focus. Mm, home for sure. Backstab gets me 24, but if we can draw into our mighty granting card or anything like that, that might be more helpful. Oh, well. now you show up focus. Oh, and so the delight doth work. And so I think we need to focus the first guy, honestly. Since we can't really target the bad guy other than with spells. 
everything else we have targets the front line. So we should do that. Uh -huh. And then we can focus. And there's smoke bomb. We can vanish after we backstab. Yeah? I don't need to, though, so I'd rather save my mana for next turn, I think. Yeah. Okay. Hmm, we evaded half. Pretty good. Pretty good. Mathematically accurate. I like it. Hmm, Maxstab just wins here. Any reason not to do it first? No? Okay. Then... Hmm. I think what I want to do is smoke bomb, try to see what we draw. We can mana shield twice. I was just debating whether I could get, like, focus or shadow focus so that we could get another four shield for no good reason. Um... I already have 100% crit chance. The only real question is if I can get... Yeah, battle ready. That might be worth it. It was worth it. And then we win. Okay. Sweet. I am liking how this is turning out. Thank you. Hmm. I see barrier we don't want. Preparations is just another good one. Uh, arms race. Gain two mana. Draw one strike if your previous card... Okay. I like it. It's more cycle, it doesn't cost any mana. We want to save our mana for being able to draw cards and stuff, but if we don't need to spend it on that, then even better. And so we go into this mini boss, which is a singleton, which is probably the best, yeah, best case scenario, right? Okay, so I can shadow focus immediately. Then, backstab. Hmm, so we want... Hmm. I think we smoke bomb real fast just to see if we can't get something else good. Eh. Let's shielded strike. See if we can't arms race into something that helps us. I mean, more shields aren't bad. Uh, even though it's just debuffing me, really. So I would rather get something that would buff my backstabs, but hmm. I think we just take the damage we can do and I save my mana and my smoke bombs for drawing in the future. Okay, we got double vulnerable, I think, and weakened. Oh, poor Merle. She skipped arm day, I guess. Oh. Hmm. Okay, well, we have our Normal focus, so we want to spend our mana down with introspection. Then we can focus up. Yes. Hmm. I can vanish. But we need a critical hit first for that to cleanse. So let's look for... Can you crit? Not at the moment. Okay. Um... We're definitely doing all this stuff. No reason not to. We can then do that. We can still create a smoke bomb. That might help us find a good card. Uh, is Vanish gone forever or am I just dumb? No. That must have been the smoke bomb. Okay. Then we can Corrupted Blast, make you vulnerable. And then we can do more arcane damage. And then we gain more shield. And then we hope that we will not yield, but this guy will. It's too bad we got our giant amount of shield on the turn. No, actually it's fine, because you're not actually attacking this turn, are you? Hmm. But that shock should probably stick around unless we can cleanse it. So, we'll have to see about that. We can get the home. Backstab does get a crit. Draw some more stuff. Okay. I debated saving that for our backstab. You know, doing that, getting the mighty first, but... <sighs> I was hoping to fish for more stuff. We'll see. And then we have more smoke bombs, and that's fine. 
If they can't hit us, it won't matter if we take 100% or more damage or not. Right? Oh my goodness, that's like 52 damage. Well, I guess 12 plus 32, 44 damage, technically. If I understand the shock and freeze and everything mechanics well enough. Hmm, so we could corrupt a blast. We don't have a normal focus. We have shadow focus. Yep. Um, that is damage. I can corrupt this guy, so we'll do that. Hmm. Hmm. Let's try to smoke bombs, see if we can't find... Hmm. We'll do that for 24, get that. Get our mana, get our backstab, yeah, okay. <laughs> well, I was kind of worrying that her shield was the... Uh, maybe a poor choice, but it worked out, it worked out. All right, then. So we can get Magic Cannon, Mighty and Adept. Deal 20 damage to any enemy and apply 16 Arcane. Transform it to Vent Off and keep it in hand. Uh, what does Vent Off do? Three mana transform into Magic Cannon. Ah, okay, so it's like you're ejecting the cartridge and putting a new one in. Got it, got it. Aether Storm, seems fun. Ah, uh, but game critical. Yeah, okay. I like that. Mm, upgrade. What does Battle Ready become? Do you get True Strikes and Mighty One? Interesting. Arms Race. Three mana, draw two strikes. Oh, that is really good. Hmm. Okay. You guys just gain more hidden and more mana. Backstab. Oh, that's a lot of damage. That is a lot more damage. And uh, apparently our mighty only pays attention to the base damage, so that would be nice to have. You just gain more critical. Oh, but you become free? Sometimes it's nice to have that one mana, though, for reaching our zero for focus. Yeah. What about preparations? You get more smoke bombs out of it. Okay. Hmm. I am leaning towards backstab. Not hone. Um. Yeah, I think we just do backstab or arms race. So that's more mana, and we can draw more strikes. Yeah. Hmm. Because Battle Ready doesn't help us pay for the strikes. I think more strikes is better than one buff strike. Right? More attacks. I'm thinking that's the right idea. Um, I can remove something like Mana Shield... Focus is still kind of nice. Do we need two preparations? They are very nice to have still. <laughs> Does anything else give a shield other than our mana shields? Not really, other than we get some evasion and stuff, so... Yeah, I'm debating getting rid of some of my preparations. Hmm. It's a good problem to have when you feel like all your cards are just good enough. Vanish, honestly, it can be hard to get that to work, but it's our only cleansing card. I think because we depend so much on our shield, I can't get rid of the mana shields. So I'm actually leaning towards getting rid of the focus. Maybe we just get rid of introspection? No. I'm gonna, I'm gonna remove our preparations and hope that's the right choice. Here we go, dear viewer. Here we go. Forward. Into danger. Ah, this was probably the wrong choice. Okay. Multiple enemies. Check. Danger. Also check. Hmm. So we could use you to gain critical, deal some other stuff. Yeah. Okay. Smoke bomb, guide me. We got a corrupted blast. That's a lot of damage. Okay, well we got through the first guy. I was, uh, and we evade. 
That worked out very well. Okay. <laughs> Why did I worry? Why should I worry? Anyway, so arms race we do after we kick stuff in the face. Hmm. Yeah. I think I actually do this. Hmm. I guess I'll do this. Then we have our focus. Then we can mana shield. Then I can backstab. Arms race. Shield and strike for no great reason. Ah, it feels good. Okay. Then we had... Yeah. Did not matter how hard you hit us. Okay. Cool. Uh, shock Spasms. I think I'm going to play these just to make sure they're not in my deck any further. Okay. Home. Get another smoke bomb. Battle ready. Shielded strike for the win. Okay. Yeah, it seems like with this character... Just going for card draw and kills is very good. Powerful. Hmm. So Flash Brawn doesn't get removed? Yeah, okay. I think we take that. Fixed Poison applied by Strike Hits. Uh, seems pretty good since we strike all the time. All the time. Okay. Continue. We will. This is where AoE would have been nice. <laughs> oh well. Oh well. One does what one must. So we've done that. I think... We do this. Then I can do a little bit of this. And we arms race. Backstab enough already? No. I think we should search for more ability to do damage. Like so. Um, I can gain evasion. Right? Did I not gain evasion? Apparently that was not a crit. Never mind. I am locked. Okay, we poison. Poison doesn't work till the end of their turn. But we're we're fine. Merlin is fine. Lore Blossoms are not fine. They will find out the hard way that this is the case. Hmm. Let's go ahead and flash brawn. Focus. Shadow focus. Hone. Smoke bomb. Mana shield because I can. Uh, battle ready to get two attacks. One attack. One attack. 35 damage that was completely unnecessary but felt very good to have. And then did my blonde, my, my blonde, my brawn went away. Okay, I thought it would last longer than that. Fine. Be that way. Um, hmm. we do not really have any strikes, do we? You're a spell. Yeah, okay. Let's gain some hidden. Do that. We did get some critical hits. Okay, so the spell critical hits do work for that. That's pretty interesting. Um, yeah, I should have probably drawn for strikes at some point, but that's okay. We can draw with smoke bombs, right? Uh, maybe. <laughs> or not. Huh, well, we'll do this. Get the three mana, call it good. I mean, it's still three mana for free. It's not a bad card. It's just worse than it could have been. How much is this? Enough. It's enough. Yeah. Okay. Then we do this. And that's probably just death. There we go. All right, then. We continue to choose a card. We already have one Arcane Aegis. Arms Race is just great still. Gain two mana and a hidden is nice, but I think we just go Arms Race because it's mana and cards. So it's just a great card. Uh, we can event. What's our event? Oh, we can surprise attack with Merly. Okay. 
We already know we can go through here without being jerks, but I want to know what the surprise attack looks like. Oh, we only face two of them. That's kind of nice. Hmm. Is the last card you play has to crit? Yeah, okay. Hmm. So we shadow focus, mana shield, then we do a little bit of this. We can get vanish up, then we can do that. Even though we don't really need to, it's kind of nice to get the damage in. Okay, we evaded the actual strike with the poison we didn't. Huh. Okay. Then, we have focus. Hmm. Fly shock to yourself. Um, we need to strike in order to activate arms race. Then we can activate arms race. Shield strike. Do that. Yeah, okay. We're done. We're done here. Goodbye, Muntra. Hmm. Assassinate. Yeah. I mean, it's one mana kills something with 30 or less health, basically. Which is not bad. I guess we take it. Uh, and we continue. Alright. Forward. So yeah, we can literally assassinate everything other than the middle. So if I could find that assassinate, that wouldn't be so bad now. What? No, it would not be. Hmm. Okay, let's smoke bomb. See if we can't get a card we want. Eh. Eh. Freaking Aegis. Oh, they're not doing much damage to me, right? So I could just save it. We don't have to deal arcane damage yet. Let's... Backstab Upgraded Arms Race. Hmm. We can give it poison. At the very least, we're poisoning it. Right? Oh. Yeah, it's dead at the end of its turn. So I can Arcane Aegis you, which means you take enough damage that if we get Assassinate, that would be great. I don't think we introspection. We just continue. No need to draw more cards if we can't play. All right then. Flash Brawn, I don't need. I do want to know, can I Assassinate anything? Okay, it dealt 31 for some reason, but I'm not going to look it in the mouth. I guess because 30 was not enough from the shield, we had to deal 31? Okay. And just calculate that automatically? Hmm. Intriguing. Um, do I look for a mana card? This is a question. Eh. Okay, well, we'll do that. I can battle ready for free, so might as well try to find something good. Uh, we can go ahead and kill you, and then we don't take any of that. So, we're happy. Okay. Now, we have more options. Hmm. Hone is good. I think I just introspection. Then I can do this. Focus up. Uh, yeah, that was a spell, not a strike. So I'm gonna try to find a strike using all of our mana. You know what? Nope, that's not gonna work. Okay. Oh, I should have gained more mana. Okay. We still could have gained mana and then played the smoke bombs looking for another attack or something, but oh well. We'll just win. We'll just win. It's fine. Choose a card. Zap. Another draw for free card. That's not bad. Counts as a skill, not a strike. Our Spirit Swarm, we tried kind of going with spirits last time. It was a different one that gave armor to other spirits. They didn't seem to be able to attract damage, though. At least, maybe there's a card that makes them taunt or something. But I think we go for Zap because it's basically a free cycle card that deals a little bit of damage. Which isn't bad. Uh, I don't need to rest. But we can get an additional bonus. 
So what would I remove? The worst arms race, maybe? It's still free mana. But it doesn't give us the same benefits if we don't get a strike. And by being in the deck, it makes it less likely we get a strike. Uh, is there another card I hate more? Eh. No. Okay. So weirdly enough, I think we remove this arms race. And then we continue. Maybe assassinate, but we can already just KO one of these frontliners with assassinate if we get it. Which is kind of nice. Kind of nice. I'm going to do that. That. And we have options. Let's use a normal smoke bomb first. Get home. I'm going to try to draw some more stuff that's useful. Hmm, Corrupted Blast seems pretty good here. Okay, and then I think... Because we got the crit, we go for the evasion. Which may not be the best thing, but maybe we can avoid some of this toxicity, this arcane damage. Maybe we can't avoid arcane. We can't avoid arcane now. Okay. Well, unfortunate. Hmm. Well, we could flash brawn. I can just assassinate. That does mean everything gets buffed a little bit. I think we assassinate, backstab, and the poison is not enough. Okay. But it should be very simple. Oh my goodness, that was more damage than I expected. Yeah, I should have paid more attention. Okay. Um, smoke bomb. Backstab. It's way more damage than I was hoping for. Uh, focus, shadow focus, and a shield. Let's maybe get our shield strike off now. No, I think we need this first. Ugh. This is not gonna let us survive, is it? Okay. Hmm. Well, it's a good try. Yep. Yeah, just killing those things before the boss seems to be a terrible plan. And losing enough of, like, 80% of my health there was just not good, apparently. Or, you know, we didn't get the evasion, blah, blah, blah. But we unlocked some more cards. We leveled up Merle. Okay. Hmm. So what are these? Covert Strike. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know, we had Hidden though, didn't we? I don't think it removed Hidden from us. Hmm. Maybe I needed to not attack in order to keep Hidden? Huh. Hidden Storm's interesting. That seems almost bad though, because you lose mana for every time you retaliate. Huh. Okay. Well, interesting. Interesting to take a run with Merle for the first time. We gain a lot of money, honestly. Wow. And this game is still in early access once again. But uh, still a fun run. Let me know if you're still interested in Breach Wanderers in the comments below, dear viewer. You can like, comment, share, and subscribe and all that jazz. And I hope you have a great day.